Now, this might sound very familiar to you. You arrive at the airport, exhilarated about your upcoming trip, hopefully some vacation, only to realize that every security checkpoint is long line. You quickly decide upon a one, maybe because you're in hurry, maybe because you're late for your plane, only to realize that maybe that's not the ideal one or not the fastest one. Then you spend eternity asking yourself, did you make the right decision? Hi, my name is Vladislav Radek. I'm writer and a mathematician teaching here at university. Today, I'm going to teach you how to choose the fastest lane in the airport using mathematics. We're going to use some simple statistics, psychology, and maybe some game theory sprinkled on the top to convey this real solution. Are you ready? Let me start with a simple premise. People are lazy. This is why we evolved in the first place. If all lines are empty, the first person that walks in will go directly to the center, giving that he's coming up front, because this is the shortest way. So the first person will go to exactly central one. Then the second one will, of course, choose the next shortest way and an empty lane. And this is going to be the lane exactly next to the center. The third person will choose the shortest distance to the third empty line. Where all lines are full, the next person will go to the center again. This is why scientists proved that humans are often querying lines in, as we call them in mathematics, semi-normal distributions with fat tails. Okay, I know it sounds mouthful. Now, here's the interesting catch coming from psychology. Scientists studying stroke patients concluded that people tend to associate good with right and bad with left, and they feel that their matching sides presents their more dominant space. Since big percentage of population is right-handed, they will always prefer the right side, so our distribution will be more populated on the right side. Now it will look something like this. So you think you already know the answer? It must be the last line on the left side. Well, not so quickly. Let me sprinkle some game theory on the top. Some people are not lazy and intelligent enough to update their efficient strategy. They will choose the last lane on the left. That means that this lane will have slightly more people than the one next to it. And here is your answer. You always choose the second to the last lane on the left side. That's the fastest one. Trust me, I tried it myself numerous times going to mathematical conferences. And it works. Of course, this theory would work only if people don't update their beliefs and they don't obtain new knowledge about the best strategy. If so many people see this video, then this strategy simply wouldn't work. So you make sure nobody else sees this video. Hey, if you like this video, consider subscribing to this channel. We're producing amazing TV show that we're going to premiere exactly here that explores human nature, science, mathematics, literature, and beyond, trying to answer the questions that are bothering us every day. So subscribe and see you soon.